Each in a minute. Oh, okay. Ah. Some of my apps started re-notifying me, and I'm like, I don't care. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I hate notifications. <laughs> I uh, generally like text messages and Discord direct messages, and beyond that, I will agree that I dislike notifications. Yes. <laughs> well, I like I like text messaging for information. I don't necessarily like text messaging for conversation. That's fair enough. Because conversation has a lot of... Mm, a lot of non... It's, it's verbal, like when you're just talking, but there's also nonverbal communication and there's, you know, sure. other aspects to it. Well, tone and there's inflection. tonal things. Yeah. 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 yeah so sure. if you get used to talking over text, a lot of things you would not realize are being communicated by the text are being communicated by the text. Mm. Like, I've had multiple times where I was able to tell a that something was otherwise up with friends because they texted differently. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I I can do that too. The the trick is I can also tell what might be up if I hear them talking, rather than just knowing something is up. So yeah, though part of what often happens is that the same friends wouldn't be willing to verbally chat while something is up mm, yeah that is a regular thing i have personally come across <laughs> dang those yeah, friends they're getting it all complicated and stuff <laughs> yeah but you know interpersonal relationships are hard why you gotta be so yeah why you gotta complicate all this <laughs> yeah and the main benefit of text conversations is the ability to do those while still doing other things. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> like, you can kind of do other stuff while in a... Depending on what it is, while, like, talking. Nowadays you like, can definitely. Like, actually talking. This content was made possible by travelers and viewers like you. Thank you.